So, you know, something like the BBC, it's not about taking your television content and putting it online. That demonstrably doesn't work. It's about creating new formats that work. Um, the other interesting thing is that most of the video that's working and the biggest growth in video is not on websites. It's not on publisher websites. It's on third-party websites. So the game changer here was Facebook autoplay video and increasingly Twitter autoplay video. The problem with that is it's not easily monetizable yet. So uh, we're waiting to see what Facebook are going to do and what their model is going to be, but it definitely won't be pre-roll probably won't be post-roll, probably be some kind of sort of sponsored uh, recommendations off the back. So, um, you know, there are definitely advertising premiums around it, but that's also interruptive. Mm -hmm. If you put 30 second video in front of a 30 second, uh, sorry, 30 second ad in front of a 30 second video, it's back to the interruptive problem we've been talking about. So I think video ad models have to be different as well.